let me just take let me just let me just show them real quick let me just show them real quick i gotta show i gotta show them as a pokemon youtuber i should l keep everyone informed of what is to come of what is to come so let me y'all let me show y'all the lovely arts that uh, we're gonna be receiving lovely arts some of the loveliest arts you guys have ever seen in your life all right give me a sec here we go guys have you seen them so here we go this is one of them this is one of them all right so this is uh what is this guy called Gor gorging fire uh so this is entei past entei so entei before he was a dog you know, this doesn't make sense. The lore doesn't make sense because the lore behind the legendary dogs is that Ho re, uh, revived three nameless Pokemon in the Inferno Tower or whatever it's called, right? I forgot the, the name of the tower, the Bell Tower. So Ho revived these three Pokemon that died in that tower. And that was like feudal Japan or something, right? And this era right here paradox this whole dinosaur look it looks like it these pokemon came before even humans even existed they look like they came before humans even existed like it does like it, it just doesn't match it doesn't match but forget all the logic forget the logic throw the logic in the trash throw everything in the trash i do really like this triceratops looking entei but it's honestly my least favorite of the past legendary dogs all right, go gorging fire, right? Gorging fire. So this is uh, so yeah, the logic doesn't make sense for me at least. But anyways, let's keep on to the next one. Triceratops Entei. We have Velociraptor, Velociraptor, or um, I think it's a Velociraptor. Velociraptor, um, Suicune, which is Walking Wake. This is the next one that's coming. All these are coming. Wild Forces, the set that's coming out the same day as Paldean Fates. Paldean Fates. And Baldean Fates is totally going to overshadow this Japanese set completely. Like, no one's going to remember this set came out on the, 20, on the same day as Baldean Fates. Alright. So, this is, um, this is Walking Wake, Water Dragon type. He's a, pretty much a Velociraptor Suicune. Walking Wake, yes. Alright, so the, I love I do love it. I love the design. I do love I do really like the uh, this is my favorite. This one's my favorite. I know a lot of people didn't like it, that what they did to Raiko, but you know the it, he, he definitely does have the design the design markings of a giraffe, but it's not a giraffe obviously. It's like a brachiosaurus. It's like a long neck dinosaur, uh, like one of those plant eaters. I really like this one. This one's definitely my favorite. This one's definitely my favorite. This one is Raging Thunder, I believe. Or Raging Bolt. Raging Bolt. There we go. Raging Bolt. I really like this one. This one's from Wild Forces as well. Next up, Verizion. Uh, but it's not Verizion. It's the more mid version of Verizion. Verizion was already kind of mid. We're getting an even midder version, which is... um. What is this? Like iron leaves or something? Iron leaves. But you know, the and the artist went crazy on this. Unfortunately, they chose to go crazy on a Pokemon that no one cares about. Absolutely no one cares about. Uh, this uh, like I this one no one cared about Verizion. No one's gonna care about iron leaves in my opinion. So I definitely think that uh, Wild Forces is gonna be the superior pack to get in Japanese at least. Because you don't get these in Wild Forces. This, this, the set, this set is called Cyber Judge. Both Wild Forces and Cyber Judge are coming separately at the same day. Alright, so next up is... Um, who the heck is this? I forgot. Iron something. Iron something. So this is the future version of Cobalion. And Cobalion was kind of like the cooler one of the 5th generation trio. Those That trio right there. And it's still mid, still, still mid. But you know, the actually this one doesn't look too bad. And the artist went crazy. The artist just went absolutely crazy on the wrong Pokemon, wrong Pokemon. All right, actually, I think the artist went crazier on these cards than these, uh, in my opinion. But unfortunately, the Pokemon they chose to go crazy on were mid. And then we have the last one, which is the future. Okay, so the 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 future uh, the future Cobalion is Iron Crown. So this one, 
This one is what? Iron boulder. Iron boulder. Yes, that's the one. What is he standing on? What are these golden energy plates? What the heck? What the heck? Alright, so this is Iron Boulder. Yeah, I mean, Terrakion was the strongest Pokemon to use in a battle. Terrakion, but this guy... Is, I mean, Terrakion was already a really weird design, in my opinion. This guy is even trashier. Alright, but... Uh, this one, this one... No, the art for this one isn't even that great. Uh, I mean, it's cool. I like the background. The background is insane, but the Pokemon itself, meh. But these two do go crazy. The arts for these two do go crazy, unfortunately. Mid Pokemon. Now I really like this one. That's why I think I'm only I'm mostly gonna stock up on Wild Forces, not Cyber Judge. I really like those ones. Alright, so then we have Mistrevious, the future, the past version, which is like uh, I forgot. I forgot its name. I forgive me a name for this one. It's cool. I like it. The the background, everything goes crazy. Every this is so colorful. I really like the colors. And then we have um, this one, which is a more simpler looking uh, Tyrant or future version, which is Iron um, Threads. Treads? Iron Treads? No? No, 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 no. Iron Treads? Uh, he, I think. All right, anyways. Um, yeah, this guy, I like it. It really reminds me of a really nostalgic type of card. A really old, like, Wizards of the Coast kind of card for some reason. The simple look. Um, obviously, Tyranitar does look cooler in this Pokemon right here, but I mean, the 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 whole the they the this this man illustrator Tanji Matsuno went crazy. Thank you so much for that. Um, let's give props to Nagi Nagimiso. Thank you for these, even though they're mid Pokemon, but the art the art is insane. And T zero T zero T zero for the uh, dinosaur legendary beast you did a great job on those thank you very much honestly great job in general but obviously the pokemon for the for most of those paradox and all that are kind of wah. 